Glenn, after <laughs> spending the week with the team, what are the keys to this game? Hey, Lenny, yeah, when we talked with the guys in the locker room earlier today, one of the things they were quick to bring up when it came to their game plan was getting Michigan State, slowing them down in transition or even keeping them out of transition. If Michigan State can get up the floor fast, beat you up the court, they can really cause a lot of trouble, and it's going to be tough to get stops. Now, the question will be, how does K-State handle that if it, does, if it is a fast-paced, high-tempo game? We've seen K-State be really good in that. They could end up on Sports Center a few times tomorrow night. We've also seen them struggle in that area and turn the ball over a lot. So if this game turns into a track meet, how will it be for K-State? Will it be a track meet where they turn it over a lot and Michigan State scores a lot in transition? Will it be a track meet where we see about nine alley-oops to Naquan Tomlin and Keontae Johnson? That's the question mark, and I'm hoping for the second one there. Yeah, we know both teams are just full of super strong players, but which matchup on the court do you think is just going to be really big in this game? It could potentially decide how it, which way it swings. Yeah, well, I think Desi Sills could be a big one in this one for K-State. I've been waiting for him to really have a breakout game in the tournament, and he's been good and he's been contributing, but I think he's just waiting to have a really big game, and if this is a game that he gets out in transition and, and really they're able to play fast, when he gets going downhill and if he gets that left hand, he's really, really tough to stop. And, of course, Tyson is the guy to watch uh, for Michigan State. He's kind of their X factor. He's their go-to guy. So K-State's going to have to zero in on him and then – uh, it's kind of a question of what we'll see from the bigs on both sides. And uh, if Naquan Tomlin can stay out of foul trouble, that would be helpful for K-State, of course. As Definitely. Well. All right, Glenn, thank you so much. Enjoy that game tomorrow and get a good night's rest tonight.